And, uh, you know, so inherently the greatest strength is the greatest weakness in the shoulder. And sometimes we have to go in and kind of shore that up if uh, somebody has some instability. And let's talk about rotator cuff. Like, well, how do we recognize if we have it and what is one of those tears? Well, a rotator cuff is usually something that happens in a 40-year-old to 65-year-old person who's still pretty active. Um, but over time of overhead types of activities, mm -hmm. you can develop a bone spur. And that bone spur many times rubs into the rotator cuff and tears through it. Or you might fall on an outstretched hand and kind of jam your shoulder and then that jams to that bone spur and, and tears the rotator cuff. Many times when the rotator cuff is torn, you just can't lift your arm as well. Mm -hmm. And so that's when somebody should come in to see us. Um, but the symptoms are really pain with overhead movement and just not being able to lift your arm up over your head. And